Hello viewers, welcome back to Choti Hydroponics Farm videos. Let's get started to get better at farming. In this video, let's start with land inspection for hydroponics. The hydroponic setup mainly can be done on land or on the ground or on the terrace of a building or house. The first requirement from the land is its size. It will cover our polyhouse, our tank setup and our runoff reservoir. A second most important requirement is land leveling. The third important thing is to make sure you have solid land and not riverside land or land with underground water spillage problems. Now let's dive into the water inspection part. In a hydroponic growing system, water is the primary medium for delivering nutrients to our plants. Poor water quality can cause disease, toxicity, dehydration, low yield and other growing concern. Bad water can kill your plants in days, if not hours. In a hydroponic system, you have direct control over the nutrients that you provide to your plants. Water testing looks at the quality of the water to ensure that your plants always have access to clean water and a proper intake of nutrients. Firstly, you need to make sure you set up a plant where you have access to clean water. It can be well, tube well, or even government supply will do or RO setup. Let's see what you should be testing and what you can do to simplify this process. There are three key variables you want to test for in your water. That is pH, conductivity, and temperature. Now, here, this slide is about testing the temperature. The ideal water temperature for most plants is between 64 and 68 degrees Fahrenheit. That is between 18 to 20 degrees Celsius. Freezing or boiling water can damage your plant, even the plant roots, and not conduct nutrients properly. Some plants require specific temperature range in order to flower, bud, and grow. We will now end this session here and continue to a new session video in the next upcoming video here. So thank you for being with me. Goodbye and have a nice day.